In this tutorial, you will learn how to generate a bomb and transfer the netlist from your schematic. First, let's add some extra information to the properties of some parts on the schematic. Step 1. Select all components on page 1, then right-click on the schematic and go to Edit Properties, where a new tab with a spreadsheet-like interface will open. To add a new field, click on New Property. Within the Add New Property GUI, we'll enter the name of the property as unit price in US dollars. Similarly, you can enter any other properties as well. Fill the sheet with any other required information. After adding the properties and property values for all components, be sure to save your design. Step 2. Generate the BOM for the entire design. Within the File Manager, select Test.DSN and go to the Tools menu and select Bill of Materials. Within the BOM GUI, under Scope and Mode, you can see that Process Entire Design and Use Occurrences are selected by default. Here, we'll use the default settings. Under Header in the Line Item Definition section, type in the property information that you want to see in the BOM. Now copy this list to the Combined Property string, and be sure to add the curly braces to every property. Selecting Open in Excel will generate your BOM in Excel. Your BOM report will be saved in PWD, but if you want to change its location, go to the Report section at the bottom of the GUI and select Browse. Now select OK. An Excel sheet with a complete BOM details will open, and here you can edit it if required and use it for manufacturing your PCB. Step 3. Automatic Netlist Generation and Layout Go to the PCB menu and select New Layout. In the GUI, enter the input board file path if you're working on an existing project, otherwise select OK. This opens up a new canvas within the PCB editor. Go to Place in the menu and select Components manually. Here, you will see all the symbols that were generated from the netlist. With these simple steps, you can easily generate the BOM and transfer the netlist from your schematic capture environment.